Welcome, in front of me is a Samsung Galaxy A25 and today I will show you how you can put this device into safe mode. So to get started you want to hold your power button and when you see your boot options hold power off. This will then change into safe mode. So just tap on it to confirm it. And this will now reboot the device and when the device boots back up it will automatically boot into safe mode. Now in safe mode only the pre-installed applications will function and that being said not even all of them. And any application that you have installed yourself will be temporarily disabled. So while you're in this mode you can troubleshoot it and if any application was causing you problems obviously in safe mode it won't be able to run so it should, shouldn't cause you any kind of problems. And you can manage it from there. So let's wait for the device to boot up. There we go. And as you can see, we are now in safe mode. Though I don't have any applications that will not run in here because none of them have downloaded yet. Uh, but as you can see, any kind of application like this one uh, that hasn't been downloaded yet, which some of them are quite rudimentary like clock or calendar, calculator, um, those, all of those applications will not work in safe mode. Now they are not showing up as not working right now, they're just showing up as applications that haven't been downloaded yet. But there is one that you can see that is downloaded without my permission and fortunately it won't run. So Zuck can Zuck on these nuts because uh, Facebook is one of those applications that gets uh, completely dumpstered on in safe mode. So it can no longer spy on you. What a pleasure. Uh, now it does come pre-installed with this device unlike applications that you might find use for Facebook. Fortunately is one of those that I believe you can uninstall, right? Oh no you can. Okay there we go. Bye bye. Uh, in any case any kind of other applications uh, you can also get rid of to this kind of means. So anyway, once you're done with this mode and you want to go back to the normal one, hold your power button and simply select restart. When the device boots back up, it will automatically go back to the normal mode. And with that being said, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.